guys welcome back to my channel i really hope y'all enjoyed this video hope y'all stay till the end and yeah if y'all want to see uh how i got this look just keep on watching hey guys today i'm gonna film a little quick video on my uh eyeshadow and um it's just gonna be like a yellow color with like oranges in them and blues hey guys so i already started uh one of my eyebrows and i'm using this la color browy wowie pencil um, I don't know if I'm saying it right, but that's what I'm using. Um, I started from inside here and then work my way all the way to the outside of my brow. Um, I haven't done my eyebrows in a minute. So we're going to make it work. There we go. It might look sloppy right now, but I'll fix it in a bit. I'm going to go ahead and do my other eyebrow. Okay, guys, so I'm already done with both of my eyebrows. And now I'm going to be using this Ardell uh, Brow Defining Kit. And I'm just going to use this uh, lighter brown one. It's kind of like a brunette color. And I'm just going to use the little pencil that came with it. And I'm just going to go ahead and fill in. Because with the pencil, it kind of leaves uh, some areas where... Um, it's not shaded in. I don't know why my hairs are so freaking crazy. I think that, that looks okay. And now with the little spoolie at the end, I'm just gonna brush it like this. And I'm just gonna clean up my eyebrows. It really helps, guys, to clean up your eyebrows. It really helps. And it's gonna help me cover up those hairs that I have everywhere. I have not done my eyebrows. I really need to do them. And I'm just going to go ahead and put it all over the lid. Since I'm going to be doing an eyeshadow, you want to cover all that. Like this. Okay, guys, so I'm done with putting on my eyebrows and putting the uh, concealer on my eyelids. Not concealer, but it was actually foundation. Now I'm using this clear powder just to set my eyelid and get ready for my eyeshadow that's it you just got to put a little bit on it like that and it's gonna be ready for your eyeshadow so I want a uh, clean cut so I'm gonna go ahead and use some tape just so the eyeshadow could uh, stay in this area right here there we go and I'm gonna put tape on the other side and that makes it look clean like that okay and now we're ready to do our eyeshadow guys okay guys so I'm gonna go ahead and use this palette that I have right here it's called festival 35 shade pro pigment palette I got this at Walmart for like $10 and the payoff is pretty good so um, this is how it looks like I'm gonna go ahead and start the look with um i guess this yellow color right here yeah i'm gonna go ahead and do the yellow okay guys so i already put some of that yellow color in here and i'm just uh packing it on and blending it like that and then i'm gonna go ahead and do the other cut the other eye and then i'll show y'all what other color is going to be next okay guys so i'm done doing the yellow and now i'm gonna go in in the crease with this little orange color just to define it I'm adding the orange little color. It's kind of like an orange, dark brown type of color. And I'm just going to put it like that on the crease and in the outer corner. Like this. Just blend, blend, blend. Grab a little more. And then blend, blend, blend. The key to eyeshadow is is always blending okay guys so i'm done doing the orange uh now i'm gonna go ahead and go in with this concealer and this little like line brush i don't know if y'all could see it looks like this it's kind of angled and we're gonna go ahead and do the little crease right here so i can add another colored shadow and you're gonna kind of look up and then you see how it marked right there that's how far you're gonna go with this like that there we go kind of looks weird we're gonna fix it 
I know. You see what I do? I go straight and then I kind of twist it out. Twist it to the outer corner. Okay, so I grabbed this other eyeshadow from this palette. It's called the Makeup Book Pro Eyeshadow Blush and Bronzer. And I actually got this one from Sally's for like four bucks. I'm gonna use this little yellow one. I don't know if y'all can see it. But I'm gonna use this little yellow one right here. Right here, it's kind of glittery, shiny. And then I'm gonna mix it with the other one that I used from the $10 palette from Walmart. And it it's actually showing pretty, pretty good, so. Mixing both together. And then you're gonna pack it on here. Where you put the concealer. Like that, open your eye up. Grab a little bit more and then mix it in with this one. just pack it on there until you feel that you've reached the color that you like or it looks if it looks good just leave it alone I'm gonna pack it on a little bit more just to make sure the color is actually really sticking on there the eyeshadows not falling off there you go okay guys I ended up doing eyeliner I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. Oh, my eyes are so red. Like that. And then I'm gonna put some mascara on. I'm gonna use this mascara. It's by um, Maybelline. It's Colossal Big Shot. I'm gonna put one coat of it. I'm gonna leave the eyes alone for right now. And now I'm gonna put this Wet n Wild photo uh, focus matte primer it's like a little glue stick so you just push it up like that twist it up and then I'm just gonna put it all over my face under eye come on eyelash don't get stuck the other side like that. nose I don't know I put primer all over my face my face is actually looking a little bit better. It was so bad. I hate that redness on my face. I've tried so many products and it's just not working at all. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put my foundation and I use the Glamouflage Full Coverage Foundation 16 Hour Wear in Honey. Um, and I'm just gonna apply it. It has a little wand like that. And I'm just gonna put it all over my face. I actually like doing one side. I don't know why I feel like this foundation gets dry really fast. I don't know why. That's just me. And then I'm just going to use a little flat uh, foundation. It's actually a powder blur. blur blah, blah. It's actually a powder brush. I'm going to use this for my foundation. Um, it's actually a flat uh, head uh, brush. It's kind of look tight right here. And it's from e.l.f. Powder Brush. It's a powder brush, but I like how it looks, how it blends my foundation. So, I don't know. It's just me. And I always do just one side first, like I said. Try to blend it. There you go. I'll do that under eye. I do not know why this is like this. There you go. Okay. Kind of does go with my uh, color. The other time I did a makeup video, it kind of looked too white. Now I'm going to do the other side. There we 
There we go. Okay. Now we're gonna do the concealer. I'm just gonna use the foundation that I was using to do my uh, eyebrow, my eyebrow cleanup. And I'm just gonna grab it with my finger like this, and I'm just gonna dab it under the eye. Am I the only one that does this when I do that? I do that every time I curl my eyelashes, and I do that every time I do this. I don't know why. I feel like it's gonna help. Yeah, but then it's gonna help. It's gonna help. <laughs> Uh, have it like that now I'm gonna go with the elf powder and medium to light light to medium actually and I'm just gonna use a regular powder brush this is what I use go in here like this I really don't bake under my eye I just push the powder in there okay guys so we're done with all that we're gonna use these eye eyelashes in the name page body by kiss Okay guys, so I already got one eyelash on. I grabbed my little uh, eyelash tweezer thing and I'm gonna go ahead and apply the other one. Make sure you point it down. And then with this, I'm just gonna grab the little inner corner of it and then push it in. Grab the other one, push it in. The closest you can to your eyelash, to your eyelash line. There we go. My eyelashes are on. It really makes a difference when you wear eyelashes. Okay, guys. So I'm gonna use this um, bronzer from Rimmel, and I'm just gonna use this little uh, contour brush from um, Real Techniques. <clears throat> I'm just gonna go in there and do this. Just to make my face look a little bit slimmer. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna do a little bit of my nose. I don't really I don't really do my nose. But I, um like all perfect and stuff. I just do a little bit of that. And then I do my forehead like this. There we go. Okay, there goes the other one, and then I'm gonna do my nose. Hey guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this short video on this makeup look. I hope y'all hit the like, the subscribe button to this channel, and yeah, just uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed it. Yeah, until next time guys.